au hata watu binafsi yeah. ambao wanakuja kupata ushauri na saha hiyo counseling yeah. ila hawajajikubali yeah. kwamba hawa hawaja accept kwamba wana tatizo yeah. na hivyo they are not ready kupata yeah. ushauri huu mm -hmm. lakini changamoto ambazo zinawakumba nyinyi sasa kama washauri na saha mm -hmm. maana huenda ikawa kuna maneno mengine ambayo watu watakuja kwako wa kueleze yeah. yawe ni mambo ambayo yeah. yatakushtua Ndiyo. kama mtu binafsi uh -huh. tuzungumzie hilo changamoto wanazopitia yeah. washauri na saha alright so <laughs> kilekitu yenye tunafaa kwa tunajua pia washauri ni binadamu mm -hmm. so what happens is that hata si tunapitia issues mm -hmm. so sometimes unaweza ingia kwa therapy room alafu the issue maybe the one yenye ulikuwa unapitia it's the one the person is going through mm -hmm. so it happens yenye unaambua unaweza kuwa triggered as a therapist so what happens immediately as a therapist to realize you're triggered you immediately go for therapy yourself and ensure your issue immediately you're not supposed to be dealing with a therapist with a client if you're going through that issue mm -hmm. so what happens ni ati connect you need to a referral so ukishaingia kwa therapy room you realize you can't you explain to the client enyewe kuna venye mimi sitaweza his situation but it's not that it's ni wewe but i might not be in a position but i can refer to mwenye mm -hmm. anaweza kukusaidia mm -hmm. so what therapists are told is that you need to also go for sessions yourself mm -hmm. and ensure you're emotionally ready to actually deal with that but in case it happens just you go to therapy and then you refer that mm -hmm. client mm -hmm. uh, kwa hivyo uh, hapa Nairobi mm -hmm. tunawapata wapi yeah. uh, kwa wale ambao wanafuatilia kipindi hiki na labda wana uh, familia jamaa mm -hmm. wao ambao wanapitia changamoto mm -hmm. au hata ni watu binafsi ambao wanapitia matatizo haya ya afya yeah. ya kiakili wanaweza kuwapata wapi ili kujiunga mm -hmm. nanyi So um, our main office is called Outer Ring Road mm -hmm. but here to kona different offices in different parts of the country. Mm -hmm. So in, in Nairobi we have an office in Congrad, to kona office here um Thika Road, Kiambu Road but also in Kisumu and in Nyeri and Mombasa. So if you have a challenge na una feel like you want a physical session, you just let us know and then we know where exactly are you located because one of the things to try is to make it affordable mm -hmm. na pia to make it accessible mm -hmm. for everyone. Kama uwezi, kama you in a different place, you can still do virtual if you are close to Thika Road, just go to that office and get the assistance mm -hmm. you need. Yeah. Um Awali ulitaja kwamba wanaojitokeza kwa wingi kuja kupokea ushauri huu na saha ni wanawake. Yeah. na wanaume. Yeah. Je, kuna mikakati ambayo mumeweka kama mm. good news uh, mm. mental space yeah. kuhakikisha kwamba hata wanaume wanajitokeza. Yeah. Maana pia wao wanapitia mm. changamoto yeah. kwamba tunaona pia idadi ya watu ambao wanajitoa uhai mm. uh, wanaume mm. ni wengi. Yeah. Ila kujitokeza mm. kuja kuzungumzia shida yeah. wanazopitia mm. si rahisi. Yeah. Kwanza kabisa tueleze ni kipi hiki ambacho labda mm. kwa mtazamo wako kama mshauri na saha yeah. unaona kwamba kinawazuia wanaume kuja kupokea ushauri yeah. na pili mm. tueleze ni mikakati ipi ambayo mmeweka kuhakikisha mm. kwamba pia wanaume wanajitokeza. Yeah. 